Hey guys, welcome back to the Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask. In the last part, we started collecting the Zora eggs from the Gerudo Fortress, and I think we've got all we need from there. And now we can, um, yeah, start searching for the last ones that we still need. And for some reason, I know um, that we have to go through some turbulences <laughs> underwater. And we need a seahorse that can guide us through there. But I'm not quite sure how we get it. So let's talk to the dude that inherits it. Or its owner. And see what he has to say. Hey dude. Well, if it isn't a Zora, how have things been going lately? Haha, <laughs> could you be coming to see me cause you can't catch any fish? It's not good out there lately. I've uh, been coming back empty handed myself. Why? I was almost hoping you were coming to share with me. Okay, I guess we need fish. Sorry, but I don't have any fish to share. Help me, please take me back to the waters near Pinnacle Rock. Are you interested in that fish? It's a rare fish, isn't it? It's called a seahorse. I caught it swimming around here, just off of Pinnacle Rock. Since it's rare, I was thinking of selling it at the town carnival, which should be starting soon. If you want it, I'll give it to you. And on one condition, do you have a pictograph of the female pirates? Ah, okay. What's this? I guess you don't have one after all. Technically, I do have a pictograph of a female pirate, but it's all blurry and it's not that great. The all important face I can't see is uh, I can't see it very well. Any good picture of a pirate will do, even a snapshot of a guard. Can't you help me out? <coughs> okay, he seems to be into the pirates. <laughs> there are not too many females around this world, so who can blame him? So let's head over to the pirates, get a snapshot of their faces, and then we get the seahorse. We can use it to um, guide us through the storm. Um, I was once speedrunning Majora's Mask for a, <laughs> a little time. And I actually knew the path you had to take um, out of memory through the water, but I, yeah, I couldn't do it right now. I could trial and error for a while, but uh, yeah, I think it's faster to just get the pictograph. Even though we have the hook shot, so we don't have to go all the way around. As you can maybe see, it's been a while since I've <laughs> recorded the last episode, like always. I will always record two or three and then I have to, <laughs> to take a break for a while. Yeah, that's the bad thing when YouTube does not give you any money at all. as a small fish in the pond. But I am doing it for fun anyway. But that means um, not as frequent we uh, videos that, as I would wish to do. But that shouldn't be too bad. I hope that at least a few people will keep sticking around. Okay, let's head over there. I don't know how close you have to be to take the picture, so... We could just try to take a snapshot of the Gerudo girls on the boats. But it's uh, way better, I think, if we just knock one out. Kinda creepy, to be honest. Okay. Mm. But the question is, does he want a knocked out <laughs> Gerudo? Oh. Okay, she's not knocked out. Wow. That's a really bad quality picture. <laughs> but I guess it should work. So, let's try to get caught again real fast. Hey girls, thank you. Ouch. So let's head back to the dude and see if it's a good picture for him to do whatever he wants with it. 
I'm not judging him. I just want his services, so... Let's give him the pig and head out real fast. <laughs> Cause I don't think anybody of us wants to see what's happening ne next. Let's see, do we have to talk? Yeah. Oh, that's it, that's it. I had a picture like that. Well, aren't you a crafty one? You will give that to me, won't you? In exchange, I give you this. We got the seahorse. Thank you. Hurry, take me back to the waters near Pinnacle Rock. And for whatever reason, uh, we know that Pinnacle Rock are uh, those two rocks. There, that's the entrance and the pinnacle shaped rocks over there <laughs> are the area that we want to reach. So let's head over there real fast. I hope that my um, my settings are alright. It's always a mess when you unplug your USB devices and replug them into different um, spots. Everything will go messy from that point on. And you have to uh, readjust all your settings. <laughs> At least the basics. But it should work. Okay, let's... Let's see if uh, Mr. Seahorse will have us from here on. Oh, he's gigantic. He wasn't that big <laughs> in his little aquarium. Uh, you have strange powers, Imp. I have a request for you. Please follow me. Okay. Yeah, um, you have to follow him. And you have to go exactly the path he shows you. Otherwise, you will fade out and um, have to redo the whole part. And if you don't know exactly where to go, which isn't too hard to remember if you've seen it once, because you can just um, use the arrow shields to navigate. Here in the depths of Pinnacle Rock live many dangerous sea snakes. My friend is trapped here. Imp, can you please find a way to uh, rid the area of all the sea snakes and help my friend? Sure. That's my second name. Okay, now we have to do a very long and tedious task. <laughs> You just have to um, get in front of those holes, make the sea snakes come out, go to the side and just hit them. Yeah, you, you are not allowed to be too centered. Yeah, and that, as you can see over there, in those holes are the eggs that we have to collect. We got a Zora egg. Awesome. And there are there are a lot of holes. <laughs> and not every single hole has something super useful in it. But I want magic, so <laughs> let's destroy the pots. On the map you can see two chests. But I will, uh, yeah, we will grab those if we kill the snakes. Ah, get over here. I think we have to kill all of them for an extra heart piece. Otherwise, we could just have a look into the holes and see which one are useful and which one aren't. So here's another egg. Let's get it real quick. And scoop. Thank you. Get over 
here. Nope, too high. This one isn't too useful as well as it seems. Oh, just one single rupee. <laughs> Get up there, please. And scooped the sword egg. This could be all of the eggs already. But let's look into every hole anyway and kill the sea snakes just to help our little seahorse friend. Do -do 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 -do. 20 rupees, awesome. We reach, reach the night of the first day, but it looks quite good to be honest. I think we can still go for the dungeon and complete it with all the fairies. Can we shoot him? Yes. Okay, we found his seahorse friend. Hey mate, thank you Imp, this is a symbol of my deepest gratitude. A heart piece, awesome. Oh, let's get a good shot that I can use a thumbnail. <laughs> Alright, that should work out. Good old seahorse lovers. Aren't they cute? Let's play the guitar at the bottom of the lake. Oh, doesn't work. <laughs> Fake news. It looked like it would just work, but it won't let us. I know there's a glitch that will allow you to um, play the ocarina at spots you shouldn't be able to, but I don't know how to execute it, so let's just take the casual way and swim up. Up what? And then I can show you how you get lost in the water. When you swim out into the open, you will just get lost and um, teleport it back to the entrance. Kind of convenient when you want to get out. So let's head back to the professor. Put the last eggs into the fish tank. Night of the first day. We could just grab a ferry for safety safe reasons. Okay, there's no ferry here. <laughs> Maybe next time. I just always want to use um, the D-pad to navigate through the menu, but it will skip the sides, it's not good. Okay, not the right spot. This works. And the last one. Let's see what happens. After we've united them again. Good. All of the eggs have been brought together. It's going to start. Quick, come to the front of the aquarium. Yeah. <laughs> 
Look at this. What does this mean? What in the world could this mean? I've got it. Don't you understand? The way these Zora's children have lined up, it means... Music. Okay. I have to get rid of the habit. <laughs> we probably have to be Zora. Not? Okay. Hello? No, oh, we have to <laughs> aim at him. I'm not... Not the Zoras. Left up, left, right down, left, right. Left up, left up, left, right down, left, right. Okay. Just a bit of smooth jazz. You learned the new wave bossa nova. It's a melody taught by the Zora children that invigorates singing voices. That, yes, it's that instrument. Huh, if the Zoras were born to teach the song, then hurry. You must play the song for the Zora who laid these eggs. Okay, let's give her her voice back. Head to Zora Cape real fast. Okay, now a ferry. Nice. Hey, girl. Oh, that was clean. We have awakened Mr. Turtleface. Mm, ah, I slept quite well. I just realized this when I opened my eyes. The passing of days is quite quick, isn't it, Lulu? Yes, Lulu, it's nothing to be surprised at. Although my eyes were closed in sleep, I still see everything that occurs in the ocean. Huh. It seems Lulu is confused. Regrettably, there's no time for idle conversation. Now then, proud Zora Boria. The open seas of Great Bay have need of your might. Quickly climb onto my back. <laughs> seems to be a very wise turtle. But he didn't notice that we are in the Zora in the first place. But let's hop on his back anyway. And head over to Great Bay.
I know that there there is a glitch that allows you to um Yeah. That allows you to um, clip through this floor right here or through the stairs and you can jump directly into the loading zone of the end boss fight of the dungeon. <laughs> Which is super convenient for a speedrun. And I knew how to do it for a while, but that's that's been years. So I will not bother doing it. Just let you know, if you ever want to beat the dungeon without doing the dungeon, <laughs> you can get into the room from this place with a very specific setup to skip through the floor. Okay, I don't have any sticks. We want to light these torches. Yeah, we have fire arrows. Let's, <laughs> let's just do it with fire arrows. Everything else would be too annoying to do. We got a chest. A stray fairy. The first one. Okay, let's get the fairy mask. Doop, 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 doop. Nothing left in this room, but this room does have a lot. Whoa, that's a huge water wheel. Okay, um, let's search the water first. Get over here, Mrs. Fairy. Okay, before we um, activate the switches, we should have a look where fairies could be those switches will change the flow of water or activate it so before we change it we should have a look over here yes at least we can get some money out yeah <laughs> could you stop this please Let's equip our bow. Oh. Not as planned. But it fits the plan we had. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm not quite sure if you should be able to reach uh, the... The lever over there. At the top. But we could reach it already. Let's see what this one does. I think it stops the water. Yes. Okay, go down here. What are you doing? This activates the water for a different part yeah all right all right all right but we have to activate this water again because the deactivation is for later in the dungeon if i'm not mistaken we should just play it normally right now Okay, get up here. No more fairies around. Very good. Oh. Alright, I saw the water would push me up all the way, not push me out. <laughs> So let's get up again. Fast. Alright, alright. 
And now if we want to skip a part, we could hover over there and activate the other waterway. Hmm, I get it. That huge water wheel is powering this thing. But I think the um, activation would change the whole direction of the water wheel and we have to explore everything to get all the fairies. So it's not the best idea to do it right now. I want to roll against it. <laughs> Very good. Alright. So that's the end for this side. Do I want to go into the water right now? I don't think so. Okay, over here. Let's not fall down. I want to go to the... Uh, those dudes here. No ferry inside. Okay, now we would have to go into the water. But uh, before we do that, guys, I would say um, let's end the part right here. If you liked the video, please leave a like and tune in next time. See ya then, and we will complete the water dungeon 100%. Bye.